Hey everybody, welcome to Falcon Plays Crooks, the big heist episode number two. Again, this is an early look at the game, and I have been restricted from actually keeping spoilers away from the videos, so there's going to be no storyline type of um, events happening. This is only a look at of the very first five missions that I am actually able to cover on video for you guys. So anyway, episode number two, let's go underway over here. This is a mission that I have not played beforehand, so this will be definitely a blind one, as opposed to the very first episode, which went smoothly just because I had an idea as to what we're doing. Now, this one's going to be a bit more difficult. Over here, what we're looking to do is actually get into this vault to acquire some alarm system diagrams for the museum, which is what we ultimately want to hit over here with the um, fake Luna replica stone that we acquired at the last mission with homeboy um, Rufus over here. Now, Rufus is going to be another person that we're adding to this mission this time around. We're going to have Cleopatra and Bishop, same old, same old, but we have Rufus over here. Now, Rufus' um, ability is going to be knockout, which is enables Rufus to knock out normal guards and fast guards without using any tools, so that could be pretty useful. He doesn't necessarily need the chloroform to knock people out. Now, if we move around over here really quickly, we have a lot of guards for one. And some of these guys have some tricky more patterns. As you can see, these guys move down their route, but they also kind of maneuver and swivel around in pace over here. So we'll have to make sure that we're not getting into the radius of this cone here. So we'll have to be more careful about this. This guy actually moves over here, stops over here, does another check through, and then comes down over here. And the same with this guy. This guy has one, two three different routes where he actually stops and takes a look around. So, yeah, this will be a, a bit more tricky for sure. And uh, <laughs> I'm not sure how I'm going to get through this one, but we'll find out. Alrighty, let's go ahead and play the heist. Everybody in position. Just a reminder. Knock out the guard, turn off the cameras, and then open the vault as a team. Alright, so you have to open up the vault as a team. Meaning, what does that even mean for us, really? Like, would you have all have to be in here or something? Hmm. Unless, wait a minute, what do we have here? So this over here is going to be a lockbox, right? Strong box. we have another suitcase over here. And we should be able to open this up with this guy over to this side, and then you get unlocked with that one. Okay. Alrighty. And then you unlock those bad boys right there. Now, there's going to be cameras, which I didn't talk about, and also a bit more tricky as well. We have a few camera jammers, which I will talk about if I have to use them, but you can unlock those, or at least um, block them out by using these terminals over here, too. So it's not the end of the world just because we have cameras now involved. Over here, we have like, an easy way to acquire some sneaky souls for Rufus, which we will take advantage of because we'll be able to grab these, and this will make it so we actually can sneak up behind this guy without drawing attention to ourselves and knocking him out. So after we grab this with Rufus, I'm thinking what we do is grab that, knock this dude out, Probably come in here and grab this key, maybe, right? Yeah, that could be it. Alrighty. It's gonna be kind of tricky. So let's go back here. We're still paused. Alrighty. So Rufus, you, my friend, are coming in to acquire these souls. You already have a, a pair of them, but let's get you with a second pair just because we might have to do a little bit of extra knockouts with you this time around. So you come over through this side. That shouldn't trigger anybody right now. Now this guy's gonna be over here moving back and forth, so I'm going to imagine that we cannot get to this room without knocking him out first with Rufus, so for now, Rufus, you acquire these souls over here, great. Let's pause here momentarily and find out how we're looking around here. Alright, so now you have to come back through here, through here, and knock this guy out. Great. So, back out here. Let's get you ready to go. And let's see. Bishop, let's get you, not through the door just yet, but just getting you ready, Cleopatra. Probably the same thing for now. Alrighty, Rufus. You now have to yeah. use these souls on yourself here. How would I go about doing that? Just do it that way? Yeah, alright, so you're putting them on now. Great. Alright, so now we've got an auto-save happening, which is good, because I might botch this. Let's see if uh, I don't. Now that we have the souls on, this is going to last for 30 seconds, by the way. We're going to come over here and knock this dude out. So good luck to you. Alrighty, there he goes, he's out. <laughs> oh, good god. Alrighty, so while he's out, let's go ahead and send a Bishop to mess around over here. We have another garden here, too, and there's also an area that a Bishop can get in through without using a key or a crowbar. So, for now, though, I'm thinking Bishop and Cleopatra into this room. Now, since we have the soul effect still on, I say we take advantage of it now and knock this dude out and grab that key for whatever it's for, and maybe even unlock this over here, which will give us access to that door. Oh, we definitely have to do that then. Yeah. Oof. I'm not sure if I have enough time for all that right there. Alrighty. This guy... Is he out? Yeah, he's out. So let's come over here with Rufus and take care of this guy now. Rufus, come on. Rufus. 
Are you still knocking this dude out or what? Yeah, I think he's still knocking him out is the problem. Uh, stop the knockout. I hope that's not going to wake him up now. And come over here and knock this dude out. Oh, good God, he just fucking kicked him. All right, he's going to be out for a bit here. Come on, Rufus. All right. That guy's going to go out. This guy is still going to be waking up pretty soon, so now we have to kind of hurry it up here. More than likely, Rufus is not going to be able to meet with us anymore because this guy will be up in that time. So more than likely afterwards, we grab the key, and with Rufus, we come over to this room, I'm going to say, and just chill out here for a while. That seems to be ideal. Meanwhile, Bishop, let's go ahead and get you... Oh, I guess we could have uh, unlocked this circuit... Um, little sensor with Bishop here, meanwhile. All right, Bishop, let's go ahead and get this out of the way now. And... Rufus, your souls are about to wear off. That's fine. Let's have you stop kicking this guy's ass. Acquire the key, my friend. Oh, no, 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 not Bishop. Bishop, hey, hey, <laughs> I forgot to switch over. Bishop, back over here. Rufus, you're the one who needs to acquire this key. Oh, good God, Bishop is now... I need to delete that movement over here. There you go. Bishop, back over here, my friend. You're not the guy for this job. You're too slow, my friend. Now, make sure we switch back to Rufus. This guy is going to be up kind of soon. Now, after he wakes up, I have to imagine him to probably start pacing back and forth over here, so we have to be careful with that. Uh, Rufus, since you already... Did you unlock this for us? Not yet. Unlock this now. Perfect. That's going to open up that door for us. How are we supposed to get around this guy, though, by doing that? Maybe we're not. Maybe we're not supposed to be doing that. Maybe... The real situation here would be to kind of go around through the security thing that we unlocked, but then this guy's going to be waking up. Huh. I might have just botched that one completely. Maybe. Let's see if I could find another alternate pad here. So meanwhile, Rufus, you're going to be coming in to this area. This is going to be waking up. Let's find out what they do after they wake up here. That's going to be the real important part. This guy is doing his maneuver here. I mean, I do have a chloroform on Cleopatra. I brought this along just in case, so this would be an ideal place to use it just in case. But before we commit to it, let's make sure there's no other alternate pad or solution that we could take here. So you, my friend... Okay, so you're stuck in this room unless we get to this terminal. Yeah. So more than likely, we're going to have to be using Cleopatra to knock this dude out. And we also need to get into this one to unlock... What is it that we're unlocking over here? Oh, the camera. Right. So this camera is being controlled by that terminal there. I get you. And this is unlocking that one. So we definitely have a few steps to take over here. This is actually a bit more <laughs> strategic than I thought it would be. Alrighty. Now this guy's awake over here. He's moving around because he's suspicious about that knockout. This guy's going to probably do the same, but more than likely, hopefully, in this room and not in the other room. So, yeah, we're going to probably have to knock this dude out with um, Cleopatra. So Cleopatra, let's have you chloroform our friend over here and Bishop meanwhile this is happening let's have you start working on this door and then we'll have Cleopatra work on this right here alright so that door is open this camera over here is gonna be a problem though this guy's gonna be out for a while it's not really a big concern this guy is oh oh hey oh he's coming over here now Ooh. Uh, Rufus, just make sure you're, uh, don't on me. Just make sure you're behind this guy's path of vision here. Alrighty. Yes. Bishop, let's have you come inside. Cleopatra, same with you. Now let's get this here unlocked so Rufus could hit the road. And any more items here that we need to acquire? Not really so far. Okay, so at least we're on this side now. That's looking a lot better. This guy's going to do his little wumpty woo walk around here. Rufus, next one over. Come over, unlock this switch. And that's going to give us access to meet up with the rest of the group now. So we're a bit closer to the edge, and I'm about to break everything you say to me. Um, door, I would appreciate if you actually closed. But apparently you're not. Alright, what's happening in this room here? Well, this room, as we can see, is going to be unlocked through this terminal here. But there's a camera in this terminal, so we can't really do much with that one. I guess this would give us an easier access to this area over here, because there's no items here. But, um, for now, how do we get through this shit over here is my other question. Oh, we just unlocked that with that switch. Alrighty, perfect. So, the rest of the group... Oh! You see this little radius right here? That is the camera from right here. So, let's make sure that he's not going to be spotted, but let's make sure that the other people are not going to be spotted either. So, oh, there's a guard over here. I forgot about this guy. 
Yeah, there's definitely a guard over here moving back and forth. Uh, we do have the sneaky souls left over with Rufus, so we can knock this guy out too. The cameras over in this area worry me though. So how is this one going to work out? We have some more money over here, some more loot if we want to take care of that. So you would have to switch this and then hit the road. So I'm thinking we're going to play a little bit of a cat and mouse game with this guy. Oof. Okay. This is going to be bad. Uh, more than likely, though, we keep Rufus, or not Rufus, but Bishop back here for now because he's a slow one. At least um, Rufus and Cleopatra could move a bit faster. Although, would it really be ideal to have two people running around here? Maybe just Cleopatra since she's faster, huh? Yeah, I think Cleopatra's going to be the one for this job. So, Rufus, after you're done over here, let's just get you behind this pillar. You should be fine. Bishop, change of plans. Oh, no, 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 no. This is the change of plans here. Let Bishop, right here. Now, this guy's gonna come over here and then do his little whoop de woo there. Let's pause momentarily, Cleopatra. Meanwhile, you have access to this area. Let's get you to start unlocking some of these saves here for us. Now, I hope this guy cannot spot Bishop behind here. I mean, ideally, he shouldn't, right? I mean, it doesn't seem like he should be able to. I mean, he stops here more than likely. Let's see how this works out. Yeah. So he stops right there, and what he's looking at is going to be the red marker over here, which is apparently looking directly at Bishop, actually. Hmm. Ready we might have to move him back here just to be safe for sure. Alrighty. Cleopatra's opened that up for us, which yeah. is great. Um, just because I want to get extra money? <laughs> I'm going to do this, but I really... Not seems too advisable right now, but it's fine. Just grab that. Oh shit, he's coming! This guy actually moved relatively faster than I thought he would from that point. So Cleopatra, just hang out here. Is he going to notice this door open? Like, hmm, why is this safe open suddenly? Oh, he totally noticed it. He totally noticed that door open. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. These safe doors just don't suddenly open on him. Alrighty, Cleopatra. Move back here. We're going to probably have to knock this guy a little bit prematurely with Rufus. Okay. No? You're not going to go inside the room and check it out? I'm so glad you're not. Although, that's a really bad choice on your part. Just my oh, excuse me, where are you going? Hey! Hey, hey, hey! Oh, good god, he's coming over here! Bishop! What is the plan? The plan is for you to move a bit forward, and the other plan is for Rufus to put on those shoes now. Oh, fuck. This guy threw me off completely. <laughs> Alrighty. You, uh, my friend, put those soles on. Do we even need him on right now? This guy's already alert. Yeah. Man, fuck putting those things on. We, as soon as he turns around, we're gonna just knock him out. So, let's go ahead and delete that waypoint. Move as much as you can, Rufus. Knock this guy out. I think I botched this here a little bit. Knock him out. There you go. Perfect. So he did, you know, capture. I mean, he did notice that we were sneaking out on him, but that's okay. There's nobody over here that's going to actually hear his cries of help and plea. So this gives us time for Cleopatra now to come over here and acquire this strong box. Oh, we don't have a... We do not have a crowbar to get in there. I think we'd probably have to use Bishop, although I'm not sure if Bishop can get into that. Yeah, we have no crowbars for that strong box, so we'll ignore it here for now. Let's actually focus on the main task at hand here. We have camera being pointed down to here, and this camera is being controlled by that over here. So this camera is being controlled, both of them as a matter of fact, are controlled by the terminal in here. So Cleopatra, let's see, we want to have you move all the way around. We'll have to open that up. Would opening this up right now going to cause an issue with these cameras being um, pointed over here? They'll see this thing open up, maybe? I don't know. They did say to leave this for last though, so that's got to be a clue for something. So what I'm thinking we do is Cleopatra just have her move around here for now. Is um, Rufus done killing this man? Yeah, for the most part he is. Alright. Bishop, I don't think we could be here much longer, so for now... Let's have you... Come up here. And Rufus, let's have you also join a foot. Cleopatra's over here already? Great. Alrighty. So, more loot in here. Let's come over here with Cleopatra, unlock this one. 
and that's gonna give us access to this terminal. Now this over here, let's see, core of the local video surveillance, a thief can disable connected cameras here and reduce heat by using the video magnet to erase the tapes. Ah, luckily we don't have no heat right now, so that's fine. Now, I'm thinking, what now? I'm thinking, Rufus, just hang out there for a bit Got longer. A Bishop, I don't think you need to unlock this one, so we should be fine. You're hanging out here, it's okay. Yeah. So let's keep him here, Cleopatra. That's gonna open up. Let's have you... God damn, my nature to acquire all sorts of treasure. Come over here and grab this really quickly, and then we'll have you hit up the terminal over here. Come on, hurry up. No time to dilly-dally. Now that's done with, let's come over and unlock this one. This guard is gonna be out. So, what he could do with Roof is actually stay on top of a guy and keep him out longer, huh? Good. Alright, it actually, actually works out pretty decent for us. And she now unlocked the cameras over here. Great. Now, this door over here needs to be unlocked with this switch, so once we acquire the plans, we could just come down, mosey down through here, and get to the exit. Okay. This is somehow simplifying here after the initial confusion. So, Rufus, you continue pinning this guy, or do we now... I mean, they said that all three of us had to be here for the plans, right? Huh. Well, let's find out that's true or not. Cleopatra, come back over through here. And hit up this switch. And let's Bishop. Meanwhile, let's have you hobble over here and hit this switch. Now, there's a guard over here that moves back and forth, so... Alrighty, that's opened up now. Before we get in there and grab these plans... Let's have Cleopatra. See if we can just grab them alone with her. Now... Ready to serve. I know I said to open this up now, but I'm thinking we open up that door once this guy decides to turn back. Because right now what it's going to happen is going to move up here and see, see, stop. Oh, wait, wait, wait. He only scans over through here. My worry is he's going to notice this thing open and be like, hey, what's happening over here? And come and check it out. Well, l let's hope that's not the case, right? Maybe. I mean, I could just cancel this out now, right? Yeah. All right, you know what? Let's just go ahead and delete that. Just hang out there for a second, alright? Meanwhile, she'll grab the plants. Congratulations, you criminal mastermind. Good luck with the circuit diagrams. They're top of the line. You'll need them if you're going to get to the lunar... Alrighty, um, that wasn't really... didn't reveal much of the story, so I'll keep that in. Um, so, I was worried that, you know, that's gonna trigger, like, everybody down to the vault, but I don't think it did, so I think we're fine for now. Great, so we have the plants now, and let's see, Rufus, I think it's about time we get off of this man over here. And, or is it? This guy is still walking up here. God damn it. Well, let's have this just walk here in the meantime. It doesn't seem like anybody's coming up here now. And then Rufus is still on top of this guy, so that's okay. Let's have Cleopatra come down over here and get ready for once we open this up, we'll have everybody just book it at this point. And this guy's the one that's being like a real ass over here. Come on, dog, just come back to your route over here. You're done over there. Yeah, there's nothing there, it's just a door with a room. Keep walking. There you go. Keep Christopher walking if you got to. So, for the most part, everything else seems to be ideally fine for us. Yeah. So this guy will do his little thing over here. He'll turn around and go back around. So at this point, I think what with Bishop, we can definitely open this up now. Without drawing suspicion. Right? Right? Okay, great. So he's turning around now. Good to go. There's going to be a strong box over here, which I'm pretty sure we can't probably crack open without a crowbar. This one we can get into. We would have to open this up with Bishop. Now the thing is, is this worth it when the exits are like right there? I mean, we could knock this guy out for sure. Oh, wait, wait, I just realized we can get through there, guys. There's a camera right here. Oh, boy. They didn't even consider that one. Did not consider that one. This door's been unlocked, though, so what we could do is actually just loop around, right? Unless, um... Oh. Oh. That's actually unlocked with that switch over there. So, even if we came into this room, we cannot get out of it. And the camera is pointed right here, so it's still not an easy way out as, as much as I imagined. Well, we do have a camera disruptor on Cleopatra, which I brought along just in case, so I think we're more than likely have to use that one, because there's no way for us to get in through here because this is still locked. I don't think we could open this door up. Yeah, it needs to be opened up with a switch. I was hoping we could use the key that we have on Rufus to open that up. I don't think it's going to be possible. We could probably use the key that he has to open that one, though. Can be cracked in different ways, which Rufus does have access to. Alrighty. I'm thinking now, Rufus, we're done pinning this guy down. Let's get you 
Well, I don't think you have to go all the way over there, so let's just delete that entire movement spree. Alrighty, yeah. Knock him out. Let's get you running over through here now. Alrighty. So, this rig is going to be a worry. More than likely, we might have to enter a room, hang out for a while, and let him pass by one more time. So, if we are indeed doing that, the strong box is here. We might want to get Rufus to come all the way over here. Rufus, can you, like, speed it up here a little bit, buddy? It's no time to swag around with that, you know, amazing sights that you got yeah. going on here. Bushup, uh, Bushup. Bishop, meanwhile, you are going to come in here and start trying to crack this door open. Oh, guard's going to be moving back and forth, but I don't think he should be able to notice this here, right? Neither is the camera. Okay. It's kind of a close one for sure, but we should be fine. Rufus, let's make sure that we can open this up. Oh, we can't use the... We can't use the key on this. I was hoping you could. Nope. Alrighty, well, I gave it a shot. So, let's see here. What I'm thinking, Rufus comes into this door, this room, and then when this guy does his trace back, he'll move over here and we just knock him out. Cleopatra. You, the camera's over here, by the way, so we have to be careful of moving beyond this point. Cleopatra, you could just probably hang out in here with Rufus as well. Alrighty, Bishop's done with this door. Great, he's Got the slowest one, so he should probably just hang out through here now. Let's also have you acquire this meanwhile. Alrighty. So, so far, this is looking fine. This guy will be turning around pretty soon. Here's our exit, we're almost out of here. All we need to get through is this camera. And we're going to have to focus on using the Disruptor. I don't know how to use that, by the way, so <laughs> that should be kind of interesting on the way out. All right, guys, and while I was waiting around for this guy to complete this route over here, my initial um, fear that I had a while back before we opened up this door and went in here was that he would notice his door open, and he definitely did. As you can see, he's coming over here now. He's like, hey, you got to be kidding me. Let me just wobble, wobble, wobble over there. He'll come up here, and he'll do his little loop around. So hopefully once he's up, he spotted more doors open. You know what? This gives us the perfect time because he's going to go through here, and then through here, right? This might give us enough time to actually get by him without knocking him out. So, this is going to be the moment of truth. Let's find out how this camera disruptor works here. Deactivates the camera for 30 seconds, making it impossible to pass through its vision cone. Alrighty, Cleopatra, let's um, check this out. You, my friend, better take your time over there while you wobble around. Yeah. Rufus, come along as well, because we might have to have everybody just dart out of here pretty soon. Let's go. Oh, and Bishop. Bishop, Let's Bishop, Bishop, dude with the messed up leg. Let's get you through here. Ready. Alrighty, Cleo. Let's see. How do we use this? We click on the camera, and then we use the camera disruptor or the camera jammer. Really? I like how she just ran through that fucking thing like nobody's business. Alrighty, it's disrupted now. That's all it took, really? Alright. Well, I'm not gonna complain. So I guess meanwhile, what you could do after you're disrupted is then come over here and actually knock it out completely, and then it'll give you access to get this, um, spoils. And this guy's over here just maneuvering around meanwhile, so actually, we have time to acquire more spoils, because yeah, they're over here just kind of doing their own thing. By the way, our heat meter is rising because of all the things that we're actually noticing now, so that's something to keep in mind. Alrighty, so since we're kind of clear to go to actually grab some of these items, let's have Cleo come down over here, hack that terminal. What is the plan? Bishop, there's nothing in here for us, and... We need to have you unlock this. Rufus, what now? we might as well get you coming down here as well. Alright, so the camera That's should be off now. Great. Anybody coming down just yet? Not yet. Alrighty. Bishop, you're done? That guy seems to be almost done with his patrol over there, so we have to speed it up here a little bit. So, Bishop, yeah. as you're close by, grab the high spoils, get you coming back here, and yeah. Cleo to the exit. Rufus, to the exit. Bishop, to, to the exit. And this should wrap it up for us here. Definitely a bit more trickier, but we got we through it. I mean, we definitely ruffled a few feathers along the way, but we got four of the six treasures, which is actually pretty ideal. It is for us. Okay, not bad. You know, we didn't do as great as we did the first time around, but hey. Yeah, we grabbed all the regular treasures. We There was no big strong box in the two, or I guess the two strong boxes we couldn't get into. And then the big chest, there was none in this um, level. Our level of detection was inconspicuous, so I'll take it. Hopefully you enjoyed it, leave a thumbs up, leave a like to support us a lot. I will catch you next time.